Brad Uppendale, V. Allen Productions here at the MRG annual, second annual, Drive Your Toy to Work Day. Um, today we're going to look at some cars that are some MRG employees cars, as well as some customers and some vendor cars. We're going to walk around and take a look at all these great cars. A few of them are arriving right now as we speak. So let's walk around and take a look at some of these cars and get some more information. We will. Well, we will, but you, you know, MRG. Uh, okay. Here. We're here with Mike Grams, the owner of MRG Tool and Die, at the second annual Drive Your Toy to Work Day. Mike, when did this show start? Was it last year was the first year? Yeah, last year was the first year. The Employees Club decided to uh, sponsor it, and they put it on last year. I wasn't able to be here then, though. That's right. You were on business somewhere, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, so anyway, uh, about how many cars are we going to have here today that we're going to be taking a look at? I don't know. I think the last I heard was maybe 25, but I'm not sure if that's correct or not. So. Now, were we correct some of the their employees' cars, and then this year we've got uh, customers and vendors' cars and friends of MRG cars? That's right. That's right. Uh, most of the ones behind me here are employees' cars. A lot of the ones on the other end here that are coming a little later are the uh, customers and friends and vendors. Okay. Well, great. Well, anything in particular that we should be looking at today, what do you think is the, the hottest car out here today? Well, I think that 57 Corvette over there is the hottest oh, car. Oh, okay. Well, we'll have to spend some extra time taking a look at that car today and try to get some description. Thanks, Mike. Sure. Look at is this uh, 1971 Corvette owned by Steve Sazodal, also an MRG em employee. Um, if you want to come in a little bit, Keith, and take a little bit closer look, this has uh, got a 350 engine and a four-speed transmission. This looks to be in pretty good shape. Golden color. If Steve's not around, otherwise we'd ask him, maybe it's for sale. <laughs> we don't know that for sure, though. Probably not. I think that's he's had this for quite a while. Uh, moving over here on the other side of it, we've got a uh, Chevy that's also owned by uh, Steve Soswell. Just finished that up this year with new interior. Um, last year was also at the show, but still was in the process of being worked on.